G'day guys, um, today we're watching on Foxtel a uh, game between the Victorian Bush Rangers and the South Australian Redbacks, hey, which is... Sorry. Anyway. <laughs> Sorry. Um, anyway, we were watching a game between Victorian Red... Mm. Victorian Redbacks. We were watching a game between the South... <laughs> Can you can you learn to speak English, Sandri? G'day guys, um, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> G'day guys, today we were watching on Foxtel a game between the Victorian Bush Rangers and the South Australian Redbacks, which is the Australian domestic competition, and we saw, we had to catch a bit of Cameron White's innings, which wasn't that great, but it was a short innings. Anyway, he hit a ball between two fielders of cover, yeah? And then for the next two or so minutes, the commentator started talking about how he'd placed that ball perfectly, and at the very last second, he'd open the face of the bat to get it between two fielders. Now, <laughs> I don't know about you, but this really, really, really shits me up the wall because, yeah. frankly, as a batsman, I believe you can't place right. a ball between two fielders. All right, I agree that first off, there's How some you, shots you that you, yeah, there's right. some shots you place, yeah, like the late cut yeah. or the final leg glances well, like the or dab, the laps and yeah. the dabs. Dab exactly, to, dab to third those man. ones you can place. Uh, yeah, those yeah. ones are placed yeah. to some degree, yeah. but. You can't place ones that are going to go there, there, or there. They're going to go in that general direction. If there's a guy bowling 150 k's an hour at you, I'm are you going to be able to open the face by 5 degrees the very last millisecond and yeah. get it between the two fielders? No, you can't. You, you can't. Gotta, it's bullshit. you, you got to be Sheldon Cooper if you want to like open the face. It uh. just really, really irritates me because what happens is a guy will hit a 4 and the and commentators the, oh, will go on, on and on and on about his, yeah. place the ga he's split the gap, he's pierced the gap. No, no one pierces the gap. I mean, you just hope for the best. I mean, uh, exactly. I think um, Adam Gilchrist... Yeah. I was yeah. reading Adam yeah. Gilchrist's biography recently and he said pretty much in his own words, when I hit the ball, I, I smashed I it. Yeah. And if it went to a fielder, so be it. Exactly. Just hope for the next time that it'll go through the fielders. I mean, I, mean, I, think, I think it was such a intent because it's, you know, it's a testify that this and no bat you cannot place a cover drive hmm. no one places it it's, the balls coming at you like 140 50 k's you don't have time to oh, i'm going to you know i'm going to just uh, move it but just exactly yeah, just, you, yeah. you can't do that and think about you this you can't then. do that if a guy can place the ball willingly at his own effort why, why doesn't then, he yeah why doesn't he why did the ball before he hit it straight to a fielder yeah, exactly. did he just not feel like scoring <laughs> runs that ball was he just like oh look uh, I'm on 99, I don't want the 100 this ball, I'm going to keep myself waiting exactly. for another ball, I'm just going to hit it straight to mid off. I have to say, you know, I, mean, I think commentators get, get this thing wrong all the time, I'm pretty sure in their playing days they wouldn't have placed it. Exactly, you just hit the ball and you hope it goes through the area. I mean, when you hit a straight drive, you don't place it, you just hit it straight and exactly. you just hope that it goes straight down the ground. I think shots like behind the wicket, you can place to a certain degree, to like a certain degree. your leg glance, your sweeps, um, you know, your late cut. But right? you are not placing like a cover drive anything, when there's three men no, down you, there. You, you can't place these shots through the V, you can't. And look, we may look like we're overreacting about this, but it gets really, really gets irritating really when you're watching a summer of cricket and every two minutes Mark Taylor's like, like, oh, yeah. he's he's placed that through the field. That's a beautiful shot right. there right off the meat of the bat. That's beautiful. No, was, he did not place it. No. There was one no. Time, there was one time when um, Jai Surya was batting, right? And he hit this nice cover drive, like, straight through extra cover and, like, you know, Ricky Ponting missed it and stuff. And, 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 and I think it was Ian Healy at the point, he's like, oh, it's a great shot there by Jai Surya. He's blasted that one, he's pierced the gap. I'm like, mate, Ponting just dived over the ball. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> if he was looking for a gap between Ponting's legs, well, good on him, but... Good on oh, him, he just got on. lucky, though. Yeah. It's like Shoy backed up bowling like 160 kilometers to you, and you're like, oh, I'm going to place this. To the exactly. Car. Oh, look at that, the ball's coming at me 160 k's an hour. Uh, Ooh, there's a gap of about, say, a meter between those yeah. fieldsmen. Going to open the bat by about five or no. six degrees, and bang, straight I, through. What I love, what I love is that they um, they go into the details, right? They feel yeah. like... They're like, oh, some of the, you know, they feel like, oh, if you look at the replay, you know, he's come down, front foot out, you can see he's turned his back purposely, like, the last minute just to get that deflection. I'm like, he's not that of a genius, he's not that much of a genius, you know? If anyone was that much of a genius, oh. they'd be greater than Bradman, and Bradman yeah. averaged almost 100. <laughs> if you can place the ball at will, why would you even get out? Oh, it's just... I'm, I'm, and I'm, why would there be a dot ball ever in your career? Because no. if you got a Yorker, you can just deflect it to finally, you can deflect it to third man, you can deflect it to mid on, you can deflect it anywhere well, you yeah, want. I think what, what we're really getting at is commentary, the, the, the com you, you can't place a cover drive. You exactly. Like, Placing you, you is just not hope for the best, that's all I'm saying. I mean, the faster you hit it, the more chance you're going to pierce the field. Simple as that. But, you know, if you loft it, even better. It's yeah, just... and even when you loft it, I mean, you're trying to hit it in that general direction, but... Mm. It's just, it's just, I, I, I just... For, for commentators, I, I, I would never say, you know, he plays the ball. I'd say good shot, you know? It's too hot in here, man. I'm sweating. Look at, look at the sweat. Yeah, well... Dude, yeah, that's not attractive there. Thanks for listening, guys. You've been watching Off The Mark. Yeah.